Pop the Bubbles is a wonderful song for practicing counting to 10. Bubbles are super exciting for young children. So this makes counting to 10 lots of fun as we pop all the bubbles in sight. It's a great song for pretend play or to act out with bubbles outside. Stay tuned until after the song to learn some fun activities you can do with Pop the Bubbles. Now let's get started. Are you ready to pop some bubbles? First, we have to make them. Ready? One, two, three, blow! One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Stop. No more bubbles. Let's make some more. Ready? One, two, three, blow! One, two, three, four, five, <laughs> six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Stop. No more bubbles. Let's make some more. Ready? One, two, three, blow! One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Stop. No more bubbles. Let's make some more. Ready? One, two, three, blow! One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Stop. No more bubbles. Let's make one more giant bubble. Ready? One, two, three, blow! <laughs> that was Pop the Bubbles. This song is great for practicing counting to 10. We count from one to 10 four times through in this song as we pop the bubbles, giving children lots of opportunities to practice their numbers while having fun with some active finger play. When you sing this song with your students, have them pretend to blow bubbles before we start popping. This part is built into the song and really helps to bring the bubbles to life. So don't forget to act it out and play along with that part before you start popping. It's a super fun game of pretend. Once you've sung this song a few times, you can sing it without the music for more counting practice. Have one student pretend to blow bubbles and another student can pretend to pop them, counting as they go. They can keep counting and popping bubbles higher than 10. See how high they can go. You can also play this song with real bubbles. Can you pop 10 bubbles before they all disappear? See how many bubbles your students can pop in one go and how high they can count as they pop, pop, pop. This song is also great practice for blowing out like this. This can be a little tricky for little ones. Sometimes they might suck in instead of blowing out. So it's good to practice. Before you sing the song, count to three, take a deep breath 
and blow out all together. Then they will be ready to blow real bubbles without accidentally getting the suds in their mouth. And they'll be experts when it comes time to blow out their candles on their birthday too. For some more fun blowing practice, pretend to blow big bubbles and little bubbles. How do we blow to make a big bubble? What about a small bubble? When your students are pretending to blow a big bubble, have them keep blowing and blowing until you say, pop. Then pretend all the bubbles popped at once for some giggles. We hope you enjoy Pop the Bubbles. Keep on singing, learning, and having fun. Thanks for watching. Be sure to check out supersimple.com for more songs and resources. If you have ideas for how to use this song in the classroom or at home, let us know in the comments. And be sure to subscribe for more teaching tips. Woo!